Okay, hey guys, in this video we're going to take a quick look at the new Emacs uh, Race Series 1306 4000 KV motors. And this is what they look like. Now they come with um, NSK bearings and N52 magnets, so it's a higher end uh, motor than the DYS uh, 1306 4000 KV motor. You can see here on the bottom where the the C-clip is here. As you can see on the bottom here where the C-clip is, there is a washer between the C-clip and the bearing, and that's usually a, a sign of a, a higher end motor or a higher a higher level of bearings. It's a dynamically balanced motor, and all around just looks uh, very sharp. So, uh, this motor comes with uh, four screws and three lock nuts. And let me just give you a quick comparison to the DYS motor. So this is the DYS 1306-4000, side by side. And you can see there on the DYS, the, the C-clip is actually touching the bearing. Yeah, you can't really tell on camera uh, what the windings look like. The DYS, you can see a little more clearly the this cooling motor top here is kind of hiding what the windings look like. It's hard to see. Um, but as I'm looking at uh, with my eye, it doesn't look that much nicer than the DYS. It looks pretty normal. So like the uh, shafts are about the same height. No, the Emacs shaft is a little bit shorter than DYS. They both have nice uh, silicone wires. So this is the uh, 4000 kV version of the motor. And I'm going to also have the uh, 3300 kV motors also coming in. And I'm going to be doing some thrust tests with these motors. Uh, probably the DYS 3100 kV and the 4000 kV and the two Emacs 1306 motors, the uh, 3300 kV and the 4000 kV with a variety of props. And uh, these are just the ones I have. Um, don't have access to all the props out there, but these are the ones I'm going to try. And if um, uh, if you guys want to see like some of the other props that are out there, let me know in the comments below. And I'll see if I can acquire them before I test these. So this is the Rotorex 3040 triple blade. This one is the uh, DYS uh, 3x3. It's called the X3030. And this is the HQ 3x3x4 bladed prop. I also have the uh, HQ 3x3 two bladed prop. This is a Diatone um, 3x4x5 bullnose propeller, two bladed. And then I have a dowel prop here, three bladed um, bullnose 3045. So, a couple of the ones that are obviously missing. I don't have the uh, the HQ uh, three inch triple bladed prop, and there's also a new gem fan triple bladed prop that's three inches that I don't have yet. I think it's a 30, 30 30 or a 30 40. So, I don't have that one either. So, I'm going to see if I can get those two as well for the thrust test, and um, that'll be in a future video. Uh, probably in maybe a, a week or two, and yeah, it's not going to happen right away. But um, leave some comments below. Let me know if there's some other props that I uh, I don't have here in, the, in this uh, future thrust test, and uh, I'll see if I can't get them. I, these, these are the ones that I can think of that are pretty obvious. And I don't, there might be some really obscure props out there that I'm not aware of, but if you happen to know, let me know in the comments below, and I'll talk to you guys in the next video.